excited for our first guest. He's a country superstar. Uh-huh. And a coach on The Voice. Take a look. Like Babe Ruth, I'm pointing to the finale for you. And here's why. Dude, listen. You just engaged the army of country music fans that watch this show. And here's why. I'm not just saying that. Here's why. Because that is the kind of performance, and you're the kind of guy that that they want to represent them in this genre, dude. That was killer. Please welcome my friend, Blake Shelley. Yeah! Let them know how y'all really feel. <laughs> I missed you. I missed you, friend. Oh, my gosh. We were, wanted you to come back to The Voice, not start your own freaking talk oh. show. <laughs> Oh, gosh. You know, I didn't think about that. <laughs> we we got to hang out quite a bit over yeah. voice. Yeah. What you been up to lately? Like, you got any more pets for me? Just not much. Just, you know, doing the finale and all. That's that's Is what's that coming happening up? right now. Oh, yes. Oh my goodness. The finale. It's coming is up. Now. Can y'all believe he's here? Isn't this amazing? Stop. Stop it. He's the coolest ever. Stop. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, you gave me, remember the heart you gave me, uh, you know, whenever it was? Yes. Still keep it in the bathroom. I see it Do every you? single day. It's like, a, Do you? it's like a heavy, like a paperweight, like it was gold. You remember? Yes. You don't I, even remember. No, I do the, remember. Do you, do you remember? You give you... those to everybody, Blake, don't you? Blake. It's like a no, I Christmas don't. card for no. you. <laughs> no, I don't. Yeah, okay. But do you remember the gift you gave me? Oh, yeah, I remember. What you well, gave Well, I actually gave it, uh, I actually <laughs> gave it to your son. I gave it to your son, so. Y'all know Blake sent me a whole goat. Me and my son. Hey, listen, what, what's funny about this? I, can I tell this story? Please, I want to hear Is this going to be on TV? I'm, I'm still trying to figure story. out how I ended okay. up with a goat. Okay, go ahead, Blake. Tell so me. I would walk into the studio <laughs> every day, uh, and we, we used to have the trailers around, and yes. there was like this. It's not like that it's anymore. Not? So okay. there's like this whole, almost like, because so many people on the show had kids, it was like a playground. And one day, I remember, like, I kind of walked in a little bit behind you, and I heard you say, I don't know, won't you go ask him? Yeah. To your son. <laughs> My nephew. Uh, and so they come over, and they're like, Mom says you can get us a goat. <laughs> because, because I'm the country guy on the show. You know, we just, you know, let's just call one out from the barnyard back there, you know? And so, and, and so they started asking, what do they like, you know, or whatever. And then, but th it was this time of year. It was, it, was a, it was a fall season. Yes. And I remembered, I think at some point I asked you, I said, I really would like to get him a goat yes. for Christmas. And so got him a, a pygmy goat. Yes. And then, but then the season was over, and I wasn't going to see y'all. So I, I had to, like, get an airplane to fly this freaking goat <laughs> from Oklahoma to Chicago. I mean, this... <laughs> This goat, like, had a first-class, like, ride, like... <laughs> it did! It, yeah. And we named him Prancer, and that is one of the most memorable Christmases <laughs> for my kid ever. So, I gotta actually, if you're sending us a goat, and now I finally know how I ended up with the goat, what do you and Gwen do for the holidays? Wait a minute, how do you go from... <laughs> <laughs> because you We sending... dress up our goats, and, uh, you know, we have them come in and pull wagons. <laughs> Uh, Do you have a Christmas tradition? We, uh, we cook. I mean, look, do you see how... Like, I, you cook! I'm oh, like yeah, a, so gorgeous. Do you see how, like, when I talk to you and I look this way and it's like a pelican now? <laughs> it's because I'm married to a Stefani. <laughs> and it's, it literally cooks everything all the time. And so uh -huh. our Christmas uh, tradition has become... I don't know if you've ever heard of this because I'd never heard of one of these, but it's called a... Timpano Pasta Dome. You ever heard of it? No, I've never heard of it. <laughs> what do you mean you haven't heard of no. it? And it's like this thing that you put like all these different layers of different like pastas. Like so there'd be like a like a red sauce and then like a Alfredo and then some other bull crap and then some cheese. <laughs> and it's all like in this dough and then you cook it in the oven and you take it out and you turn it over and you take the 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 bowl off and you've got this dome of like this looks like this big round crust thing and you cut into it uh -huh. and there's heaven inside of there <laughs> because it's like all kinds of you know stuff all the it's so stuff. good and y'all create these different dishes yeah but there's here. recipes but we ended up you know just making it okay now i notice so. Quinn, Gwen sings country songs with you will you ever do a pop song yeah. oh yeah we want to hear blake on the pop song 
Of course, man. I can see, I can see me doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I did do, a, we did do a Christmas song uh, yes. together that's on her Christmas album, and I feel, I'd be, I'll do whatever she asks me to do, but I don't want to see her fail. And I don't see me being able to really compete in the pop, ska, reggae world, or, or whatever that is, you know what I mean? It's like, I know, think we, it's I can drink we the rum, but I can only like listen to the music. You know what I'm saying? You could, okay, well, yeah. we want to hear you do a pop song. Do you? Yes, we I do. Bet you do. <laughs> We gonna put it out there right now. Okay, so the voice finale is this week. You, you do not want to hear that. Th Go ahead. Yes, what? I do. The voice finale is this week. Yeah. What do you think the trick is to win it since you've won so much? Well, I've been there forever. You've been <laughs> so there forever. I, I'm sure it felt like forever for you. What did you do? Three seasons I did or two? Two seasons with you guys yeah. and three seasons in the UK. Okay, that's right. This feels like forever, doesn't it? It does. Yeah. How long? How many seasons have you done? This is, this is marking the end of my 22nd season. 22nd so. Second season. So if I, had, if I hadn't have won a bunch of times, that would be really embarrassing if I hadn't have won, you know, a few of these. You, can, times, you, right? can handle, you could afford to Kelly reminds me of that, by the way, yeah. often. Like, of course you've won a bunch. You've been here a hundred years. Like. <laughs> and next season is your last? How do you feel about that? I'm so happy about it. You happy really about happy. it? I am because, you know, to tell you the truth, I don't know, I may have said this, but I had planned on, season 20 sounded like a good, like, you know, good one to go out on, a good number, and then, you know, that was right in the middle of, of COVID, right. and, I, you know, I didn't want to walk out. I mean, these people have become my family, the yes. producers and the network. And, yes. And so I just, we wanted to get through, you know, the not knowing what, we're going to be able to do phase of the show. Mm -hmm. And so now I feel like it's a good time for that. Now they have time to go and find who the right person is to take uh, my seat and, and, you know, and I wanted to give them a chance to do that before I just left them high and dry. Who so. do you think could take your seat? I have to ask that. I've suggested a guy named uh, Neil McCoy is who I've suggested a few yeah? times, but okay. I don't think they listen to me. I'm, I'm old. <laughs> I'm old at this point, and, and I'm sure they're looking for somebody newer. I don't know. Don't forget to subscribe to the Jennifer Hudson Show YouTube channel and turn on that notification bell so you're the first to see our latest videos.